Thanks for joining us on the news at 530. I'm Sam Bauman. Now each year summer tourism brings in billions of dollars to Hilton Head Island's economy. Holidays like the 4th of July seem to help out with that bottom line. WTOC's Ryan Tismaneski went to Hilton Head Island to see how yesterday's festivities affected small businesses. Owners of small businesses like the one I'm standing in tell me that the 4th of July season is one of the busiest times of the year. Officials from the Hilton Head Island Chamber of Commerce tell me that the summer months play a major role in the $3 billion tourism industry. July 4th weekend traditionally is one of the busiest weekends of the year, and this year was no exception. Definitely a sold out weekend for the island. Cash registers were ringing everywhere and people enjoying the beach. Cash registers were indeed ringing at Hilton Head small businesses. For example, Jennifer Megliori's Artware, which sells all kinds of low country artist made souvenirs and trinkets. Uh, the week of, of the 4th of July is the insanity that we all hope for on Hilton Head Island. It drives our economy. It gets us through the quiet months of the winter too. Shelter Cove Town Center has never been busier than this past week. Overall, summer tourism is a key player in Hilton Head's economy, and the Chamber of Commerce says that although visitation of the island is similar to what it was last year, people are still opening their wallets. We're seeing the summer tourism is actually about flat with last year, maybe even a little bit down in terms of occupancy rates, but the important thing to note is people are paying for those rooms as, as they were for last year, so that's good news. And while people will visit Hilton Head Island all summer long, the impact of the past few days won't be forgotten. The 4th of July is definitely the apex of our summer. Everybody gets so excited to dress up in red, white, and blue, slice open a watermelon, and celebrate America. Jennifer tells me that her shop will be riding this wave of business for a long time. On Hilton Head Island, Ryan Tisbaneski, WTOC News.